Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. So yes, guys, I love cooking, but I also love farming. So this morning, I'm going to give you a little tour or tell you a little thing or two about my layer farm. Yes, I do layer. As you can see, I just feed the layer birds. So I'm going to now pick up some eggs and I'm going to show you how I nurse um, how I grass. I am going to show you how I grass the nest and I'm going to show you how I pick up the eggs. But first and foremost, I want to tell you a little bit as I know. So each each end can lay up to 250 or 60 eggs per year. Right? And they only lay one eggs per day. Only one eggs per day. So it takes 24 hours to 20, 24 to 26 hours for the eggs to um for the eggs to, to reproduce. So they lay one egg per day. A layer in lay, lay up to two years, so they can lay up to 530 eggs. And what I know about these birds, they are very delicate. You have to notice the signs, a lot of signs. Sometimes the birds are sick, and if you don't know much about birds like myself, I'm going to, they're going to die. So we have different sizes of eggs. They have some big ones. This is not the biggest one I ever get, but you have some big ones, and you have some small ones. I get smaller ones than these a lot of times. You have bigger ones than these, and you have smaller ones. Sometimes I get some real big ones, sometimes I get some real small ones. So you can get big eggs, and you can get small eggs. So 
guys. I have a really large head. Um, look at the size. Look at the size of this one. Another big one. Look at the size of this one, guys. Wow. This is a really big one. So my farm is located here in Clarendon in Jamaica and if you're a female like me and you're into farming and you want to do poultry farming I know a lot of people here in Jamaica um, do poultry but they mostly do um, the boilers the chicken that you 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 kill to eat but if you want to do layers you can go ahead it's not hard it's not difficult but it takes a little bit of time it's not hard but the birds are expensive bear in mind the birds are really expensive so therefore i will advise you to learn about the birds before you go in you go into um layer farming but it is a good it is a good farming so you can if you're a female like myself and you're interested in farming you can go ahead and do layer farming Sometimes they will even lay on the, on the ground. Sometimes they lay on the ground. Sometimes I even find eggs in the feeding pans. They lay sometime on the ground. Look at this one here. So this is one of the first um, set of layer that I had. I had some before and dog. Dog destroyed them. But this one survived. So that's why the neck of it, the end is like. This is where the birds sleep. I don't know what you call it at your where you live but this is the roof they sleep they don't sleep on the ground I might show you in the night where they sleep but oh they sleep I might show you but this is where they sleep and sometimes they sleep on the top of the box on the top of the egg box but this is where the birds sleep So these are my layer birds. I have these birds for like one year now. February make one year or so. And as I tell you before, I don't really know much about layer before I get into layer farming. But what I know is you have to pay keen attention to them because once one is sick, the others can contract the sickness from them. So hence why I probably lose like 20 something because I never know that, but you have to pay attention to them. So you pay attention to see which one is looking healthy, which one is not looking healthy, so you can take that one from the group. Yes, guys. So, as I said before, any tips you know or anything you know about Leah, you can comment below and tell me. I, 
I will appreciate it because I don't know much. So anything you want to ask, if I can answer you, I will answer you. You can leave your comments down below. Anything you know that I don't know, you can still tell me down below. Sometimes the, sh the shells are just soft, so they will break. So this is the largest one for the morning, and this one breaks. So you have to be extra careful, guys, when you're dealing with layers and eggs. This one breaks. So this is it guys this is the eggs when you clean them up and put them in pack them in the trays so this is how they look not finished as yet but thanks for watching and please remember to like comment share and subscribe subscribe if you're not subscribed as yet so thanks for coming to my farm and i'll see you guys in my next video